forward to that. Well, now to the story making local and national headlines, the coronavirus and its detection here in Metro Atlanta. We know a Fulton County father and son are being treated for the virus and new at 430. We are pressing for more information regarding when and how you can eventually get tested for the coronavirus. CBS 46 is Haley Mason live tonight with more on those answers. Haley, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Sean. Got some news that shows the state health department may be ahead of schedule. We are live outside of the health department offices where officials tell me that starting tomorrow, the state public health lab will begin testing for coronavirus. Right now, the CDC is the only place testing and confirming the coronavirus. There are only two confirmed cases in Georgia. We went to the state health department's lab on Claremont Road in Decatur. Officials there are working to make coronavirus testing available starting tomorrow. The request for testing will still have to be coordinated with local doctors and the state public health department. Morning, everybody. Just wanted to give you a quick update on the COVID-19 coronavirus. This morning, Governor Brian Kemp announced on Twitter there are no new cases in Georgia and that the coronavirus as they know it has not spread. He asked everyone to remain calm and wash their hands. The CDC's Dr. Nancy Messonnier explained yesterday that the CDC has been releasing FDA-approved test kits. But the CDC still has had to confirm the results. They're expecting state health labs to do tens of thousands of more tests by the end of the week. CDC um, has sent test kits out to states, and those test kits are being used right now by many state health departments. Because of the FDA regulations, those are still considered presumptive positive until there's a confirmatory test at CDC. But those are actionable results. That is, the state and local health departments are using those to make public health decisions. And the lab testing at the state lab for coronavirus will be conducted as warranted. That's if a physician feels that the patient's uh, symptoms and possible travel history could indicate that they could have been exposed to the coronavirus. The Fulton County Health Department tells us that it will be planning to see more cases of coronavirus as more tests are made available. We'll have more on this coming up at 5 o'clock. For now, reporting live in Atlanta, Haley Mason, CBS 46 News. Thank you, Haley.